Salut tout le monde, c'est Carlo Combs. Aujourd'hui, sauf pour une nouvelle vidéo sur Game of Thrones. Et ouais, on va continuer notre, nos, les petits épisodes, hein, les tests d'épisodes. Donc voilà, allons-y, continuer épisode 1. On était à l'épisode. Euh, on venait de s'enfuir du machin là. Bon. Je risque de m'acheter le jeu. Ah, il s'appelle John Merton. Le... Oh putain, il est ça. Lord. Fresh. C'est chez moi ça je crois. That's father's car. Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. Winter may be coming, but at least still have his bacon. Move along, boy. There's nothing for you here. <coughs> Father, I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. I'm going to kill you. Voila. Is that so? You can try if you like. And then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get off my land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the north. I reckon he'd like a proper lordly sword like that. No. I'll have that sword, boy. Fuck you. Oh. Je 
Je tuerai tous ceux qui viendront contre moi. Father? Carl, you survived. Your sister. She hid. Oh, les PD, ils ont tué ma soeur. I tried to stop them. C'est intéressant de voir une autre, une, une autre histoire dans Game of Thrones. Oh putain, il est mort. I'll kill the men who did this. Ouais. J'aurais pu les tuer maintenant, mais bon, pas grave. Ça aurait été mieux hein, si je les tuais maintenant. Tell him his nephew survived. Carrot. I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester. Meet us in the great hall, quickly. On va organiser une guerre. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she. She was only eight years old. Hmm. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Mister. Blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Arthur. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. But the White Hills won't see it that way. It was justice. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. We can't let the White Hills just walk all over us. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? Ah. C'est bien dégueu. Ah, il est sérieux. These are dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house will never fall. By the gods, let's hope you're right. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Although he is young, and altogether unprepared to lead. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of Warcraft. Roderick had already fallen. There was nothing we could do. Hmm. Well, I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house. I or low. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first. To see if you can put any weight on that leg. Le truc que mon oncle m'a dit avant de mourir, il faut que je le dise qu'à mon oncle. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Ah, l'autre m'a dit, il faut que je le dise qu'à mon oncle. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? I guess. Dégueu, surtout. Non, 
suis en besoin. This mile. Hmm. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Mestro Tengren. Look, I'll show you. The Ironwood Grove. Did your leg feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but... Lady oh. Forrester. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family... Oui. What was it? I'm so sorry. Me too. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Whatever you can recall. He was a hero, my lady. The bravest man on the battlefield by far. Yet he was unable to save his own son. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He... he fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told... I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he past, if you can remember. He said he loved you. That's very kind of you to say. You have the Forrester's sword. Ethan should have it, now that he is Lord. Lord Forrester asked me to return it to the house. He said this is where it belongs. With his family. Thank you, Garrett. Of course, my lady. He demands a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. Now is the time to prove our strength. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Duncan, this was our land. They were our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Royland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. They killed my family. And they'll pay for what they've done. That much, I promise. But now is not the time for vengeance. It's not now. When? We have to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads, while they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett's suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. It was his family they killed. My uncle's right. We need to be smart. Smart. Eddard Stark was smart. And look where that got him. See, wait. So, what's to be done? 
Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this, I'll accuse you of murder, and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. I'd have done the same, as any man would. I've done nothing wrong. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take, which is why you cannot stay. Cannot stay? Duncan, the boy has suffered enough. You can't send me away. We have no choice, Garrett. Where would you have the boy go? The one place that's safe, beyond the reach of the Boltons. You're sending him to the war? The boy's done nothing wrong! Not in the eyes of the Boltons. I'm afraid it's the only solution. I'll do what's best for the house. So I'll go. I'm not afraid. I know it doesn't seem fair, but it is what's best. That settles it, then. You can have my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food. But we haven't much time. The White Hills will come looking for you. Word up to me. I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart if given the chance. I would, and God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. Mm -hmm. Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the House ahead of your own. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. I'll do what's best. Which often isn't what's easiest, but necessary nonetheless. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. What? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said, the North Grove can never be lost. Sorry. You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. What is the North Grove? Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools, and it's better kept that way. You haven't told anyone else, have you? This is important, Garrett. Of course not. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. From this day forward, this will be our secret. But soon, I may need your help. But I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. Okay. But don't okay. breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. Become a ranger if you can. It will help. Why? <sighs> Iron from ice. Legless Iron from ice. Remember, you represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll serve with honor. I know you will. Milady. Garrett, wait. C'est ma copine, ça, je suis sûr. C'est pas le talia. Be safe. Mm 
Ethan Bon, on s'arrête, on va s'arrêter là pour cet épisode. Euh, on a bien avancé. Euh, J'adore à fond ce jeu. Je, je crois que je vais me l'acheter direct. J'espère que vous aussi, vous aimez ce jeu. Il est vraiment trop bien. Dites-moi ce que vous en pensez dans les commentaires. Euh, surtout n'hésitez pas à liker, partager, comme d'habitude. Je vous mets les liens des descriptions. Enfin les liens dans la description. Les liens de mes potes là et tout. Euh, voilà. Et on se retrouve pour un prochain épisode de Game of Thrones. Car je vais faire la série de tout le truc gratuit. Et peut-être quand j'aurai acheté le jeu, je continuerai. Donc ce sera une petite série. Donc euh, voilà. Alors euh, on se retrouve pour un prochain épisode. Tchuss tout le monde